Hey Libsters, how are you guys doing today? So guess where I am? In my kitchen. So I'll be whipping it up today, cooking it up. Hey, hey. So, but for real though, I am going to be using Green Chef um, to cook with because it is the weekend and I don't like to cook on the weekends, honestly. Like, <laughs> I will order in Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I cook throughout the whole week. I'll meal prep, do everything. But for the weekends, mm -mm. no. So this is my first time using Green Chef. Um, I got a promo in something I brought and I ordered three meals for this weekend for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and we will try it out. I got the buttery lemon garlic shrimp, um, the honey citrus glazed salmon, and also the Swedish meatloaves. So tonight, I think I'm gonna go with the buttery lemon garlic shrimp because <laughs> who doesn't love shrimp? And that looks so good. Yeah, so I'm trying not to eat out as much, you know, say my coins, you know, I wanna get back to traveling, post pandemic, you know, gotta get back out there and traveling the world, my world traveler in me. I love seeing new places, visiting new people, just experiencing the world. Like, you know, living here, there's so much to the world that we just don't see. And I do that by traveling and by eating because your girl love to eat. So let me get all the stuff um, for, the buttery lemon garlic shrimp. I'll let you know how it goes. Hey, y'all like my little jazz going on? I'm trying to set the mood, you know? Friday night. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey. Um, I bet y'all know who I'm listening to. If y'all know who I'm listening to, comment below and I'll throw a little something your way. So this lemon, this buttery lemon garlic shrimp. All right, so everything comes in like these little packages and you kind of just, I guess, mix it together. So let's see what is in here. Oh, it's so cute, it comes with everything. So it has the linguine. Um, oh, it has the seasonings too. Oh, wow. <laughs> so this is like uh, cooking one-on-one for people who don't know how to cook. What, even the vegetable broth? Oh my goodness, a lemon. Oh, okay. Yes. Wow. Oh, sun dried tomatoes. Um, this lemon you received is conventional. What does that mean? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got that. And then we have the white shrimp. Is it deveined? I hope it's clean. Like, I don't feel like cleaning no shrimp right now. I don't want no dirty shrimp. What do people say? Dirty shrimp. <laughs> hey, shrimp is shrimp to me. Okay, so it's already be vain. This is just so easy. Like, I haven't even started cooking yet, but like, this is already so easy. Like, I ain't have to do anything. All right, you know your girl got to... Get her hands washed, let me do that. Whew. So, how have your days been going? How has your day been going so far? Hope you guys had a lovely day. My day was very relaxing, very nice, so yeah. All right, so we are going to um, make the linguine first. So let me get my pasta pot. And I don't know if you noticed, but a majority of my kitchen is red. Like growing up in North Carolina, there was this lady that um, who used to watch me, I think, or went to my church, something like that. She had a red kitchen and I fell in love with it. So, you know, like every place I've owned that was my own, everything has been red, so. I got my red pot and I'm gonna flip this around so you guys can see me cooking. All right, let's see. So I'm going to get the pot of Lady Lee started. And we 
you know, like they say put it on like that, but I like to break mine. I don't know about y'all. You know, I'm gonna do it like the Italians do, you know, like that. So I'm gonna, you know, cook that. It says to start in like, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so now I'm going to prep the sun-dried tomatoes. Thank you. Place the sun-dried tomatoes in a small bowl. I don't know if you guys can see this. So here's the sun-dried tomatoes. And cover with the vegetable broth with lemon juice and let that sit at least for five minutes. Okay, so what time is it now? All right, five minutes. This is just so cool. Like, I didn't have to go to the store and buy nothing, y'all. Like, this is already made. Okay, so now we are going to trim the ends of the zucchini. Why it says zucchini? Like, they gave me a, um, a squash. And is this stuff washed? Like, I'm gonna wash it. You know how I am. I gotta wash up my stuff. Mm -mm. Even though it's in a bag, like, I feel like I need to wash it. Okay. All right. Get my bread plate. And I'm gonna get my knife and we're gonna chop off the ends here because I don't want those. And it says half lengthwise. Oh, okay. So like this. Oh man, okay. All right. And then cut into half moon. So maybe I'll do it like this, yeah. I'm not that good of a chopper, y'all. Let's see if y'all can see this. in there okay all right so then it says mince the garlic I don't see the garlic they ain't put the garlic in here huh well luckily I have garlic so let me get that somewhere I know I got garlic Yeah, luckily I have garlic, y'all, and I'm just gonna cut up some garlic because I didn't see no garlic in that pack. Like, did I throw it away? I don't wanna go back in that trash can. I'll just use this, y'all. Like, uh, okay, I'm gonna get my little garlic pack. I got like a few you know, garlic thingy bobbies. And I get this from Trader Joe's. Like, how cute. They come like already peeled. Like, man, cutting garlic, that's tough. <laughs> I'm just not the one to do that. So I'm cutting up the garlic now. All right, I like my garlic big so I can see it and taste it. I mean, you're gonna taste it regardless, but I like to see what I'm eating. I don't know about y'all. So I did that. I don't know where that garlic is, but um, it was not in that pack. So I am doing that. Okay, I'm smelling something. All right, so now zest a whole lemon with the microplane. Like, what? Oh, like a grater thingy? What? I'm gonna clean the lemon, y'all. I mean, what? Okay, I'm... What is zest, what is zesting a lemon mean? Like, I know how to cook, but like, what the heck is zesting a lemon? I have no idea, y'all. So I'm cutting it up into fours, and then I'm gonna put it in another bowl. All right, 
like, am I getting the juice out? Oh well, I'm, I'm only gonna do two because it's not clear. Zest the lemon and then over a second small bowl, quarter the lemon. I don't know y'all. <laughs> this is not very clear to me. So I did that and I gotta wash my hands. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So now we are moving to step three and I'm going to rinse the shrimp and pat dry. All right. Ranch the shrimp, ranch the shrimp. <laughs> They fell in the sink. Hold up, I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, I was able to save the shrimp. Like, <laughs> I got the shrimp. <laughs> Man, whatever. I got the shrimp. They are here. All right, so now we're going to heat one tablespoon of butter. All right, I'm gonna get this big butter right here. Let's see if you guys can see that. Another red pot. How about I put the pasta in the back so y'all can see more here what I'm doing. All right, let's do that. Sorry, pasta, I had to move you. So we are going to um, heat one tablespoon of butter. So let me get my butter. Um, the bu There was no butter in there, but I have my butter. They like dipping me of some ingredients, y'all. All right, so I got the butter. Hmm, should I add more? I'll see if I need more later. And then, what are we gonna do? Add the zucchini. Okay. So let's do this. All right, put that in there. Add the zucchini. Did it say anything about the garlic? Not yet. They're just a zucchini. Okay. Everything is yellow on this plate. The lemon, the zucchini. Well, it says zucchini, y'all, but this is clearly squash. I don't know. Maybe they are having a shortage because there's a shortage of like everything now. All right, so let's put that in there. Bit. Ah, nice. Okay. Like for real though? <laughs> Alright, put that in there. Alright, put one to two minutes. Alright. Hmm. Them. So let's add the shrimp. Let me tell the shrimp off. Okay. Alright, get the shrimp, put it in there. Woo! I'm gonna turn on this heat. Okay. Shrimp, the garlic. tablespoon of butter. Oh, I should be watching what I'm doing over here. <laughs> All right, another tablespoon of butter. Okay. Oh, it smells so good, y'all. It smells so good. Um, seasoned with the Italian herb and red pepper blend. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. I'm just gonna dump it all up in there. Like, <laughs> that's a lot. Um, yeah, we'll do just a little bit of red pepper because I don't like my stuff too spicy. All right, this smells amazing, you guys. Wow. Um, 
Alright, so they want me to add like salt and stuff. I don't really cook with that too much salt, so I'm going to use some of my other seasonings. I'm going to use Nature's um, seasoning. Make sure I got that on the right side. And then I'm also going to use some onion salt from Trader Joe's. And some black pepper. Ooh, uh uh. We ain't gonna have all that fall off like that. No. Alright. Turn that around. Alright. This looks so good, y'all. Y'all see this? Man. I wish I could smell like how good it smells in here. Alright, so now we're gonna add the tomatoes in here. That was in that um, broth. These are the um, sun dried tomatoes. Y'all see that? Yeah. Alright, and then. Okay, so I guess they're assuming that the pasta's done, but I don't think the pasta's done yet. Let me try. Pasta done. Nope, not yet. Not yet. Um, just a little bit more. Um, y'all, it's telling me to add more butter. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. Um, there's also Parmesan cheese. Y'all know your girl can't do cheese. I'm just gonna toss this junk out because I can't deal with cheese. Like, no. No. So, I am lactose intolerant, so you would rarely see me eat any cheese. I don't really miss it. Like, you find substitutes and everything. Vegan cheese is pretty good. I find it to be creamier than regular cheese. Um, yeah. But if y'all know of any good, like, non-dairy mac and cheese recipes, hit your girl up, because I love me a good mac and cheese. Well, that's looking good. Let's check on this pasta. All right, what they say that you throw the pasta and it sticks, that it'll... <laughs> mm -mm, I ain't doing that. All right, the pasta is ready. Um, okay, it wants me to add some the stuff in here, like in this pot. Okay, I'm gonna take it off the heat. Can you guys still see? Oh yeah, you can still see that. And then, I'm going to transfer the pasta. Let me turn this off. It'll be easier if I like strain it first with my red strainer. All right. Woo, that's hot. transfer that in there like so like that and okay so I'm going oh I got some seeds up in here I'm gonna put the lemon juice that I squeezed from two of the slices on here oh that smells so good with that shrimp y'all oh my goodness I wish I could smell this all right, so it wants me to add more butter. <laughs> hey, it calls for more butter. I'm gonna add more butter. It says two more tablespoons, y'all. So that's what we're going to do. Yeah, I follow directions sometimes. <laughs> y'all know, I'm just, I've always been a little rebel. I've always traveled the road of less beaten path. 
know, it's like something in me that just does not like to follow directions. But I'm working on it, y'all, I'm working on it. All right. So let's see how this tastes. Let me kind of like do this. I'm making such a mess, but okay, most of it's gonna end up in my belly. All right. So let's see how it tastes. I'm just gonna get like a little zucchini here. Let's see how it tastes. That's really good. Need more seasoning now. It kind of fools you with that Italian seasoning because it looks like there's so much seasoning on it with that greenery looking, you know? But y'all ain't gonna fool me. I need to season my food. I need to enjoy and eat it. And then maybe I'll um, put another lemon like that. I think that'll be really good too. Um, add another lemon on there. I'm gonna do the bigger one. Take out those seeds and zest the lemon over the top. Let's move it a little closer. Yeah, squeeze that lemon up in there. Mm hmm. All right. So let's now incorporate all that together. Let's see. All right. Another small um, squash. So much better. Oh man, that lemon is so good. Okay. Mm -hmm. 